Hello there. This is um, the first uh, video vlog. Technically not the first one, but it's around the fourth or fifth. It's going to be a little bit different this time around. Obviously, we have this monster with me this time. We're also going to try to narrate it a little bit more and, and see, um, you know, what kind of goes into going out to create some photos, kind of dealing with natural forces and finding what's happening around you. So uh, today we're we're out in Seattle, Washington, and we're going to a nearby park, and we're going to see uh, what we can create from that and uh, try to make uh, some cool pictures. We've covered a good chunk of land, pretty crowded. Uh, so we're trying to find a little bit more of a secluded area to um, set up shop here. So far, the lighting situation seems uh, really nice. The greenery out here with kind of an overcast sky is, is something that I think we're gonna focus on. Uh, a lot of greens are popping really, really strong. I think that'll come out um, super nice with the, with the lighting situation. these really bright greens out of there while keeping the, the shadow. This tree is obviously going to be the main focal point here. I think it's got a pretty good structure coming out. I'm slightly worried about the density of the woods here on the left hand side of the frame, but I think we'll be able to work with that in post. We've got another pretty good tree here uh, up on the top here. Again, slightly worried about density on the right, but I think that just adds to the, to the nature of it all. We're gonna try to keep that trunk as detailed as possible and try not to blow out the highlights of the canopy too much. We're gonna try to get some people in on this one up on this log here, but dead center of the frame, uh, we have this banana slug. It's now going to be a portrait session for this banana slide. Large tree here. Uh, this stumps are a little bit of a different aspect to what we've already shot. The angle of everything is kind of sloping down this way. So it kind of gives it a very like warped effect. We're going to frame it uh, with the base of this tree kind of in the left hand of the frame. And uh, we'll see if we can get like a very expansive, um, almost like a Dr. Susie effect going straight up. I kind of stumbled upon these like enchanted steps and uh, just so happens to be a really nice sturdy tree going straight up the side here. This one um, won't be in frame, but we're gonna try to get maybe the top portion of the trees there in frame and try to get this solid tree right in the middle with its canopy up top. Try not to blow that out. We're actually trying to hit that, that overcast sky. The sun kind of came out here in the last minute or two. It's kind of blowing out those tree canopies. I'm kind of glad that we got the few that we did. Uh, might be a good spot. Uh, just for a wider landscape, we've been shooting a ton of uh, portrait landscapes. And we've got this bottom root definitely in frame. We're going to get some of these ferns in here on both sides. It's going to frame the edges. This is going to be the center path. And we're going to get a good chunk of these trees up here. So this is obviously the first time um i'm really digging into the the first person vlog world i didn't really think through uh such an inclined hike during a vlog where i have to actually talk and be very out of breath cardio might be something that we look into uh, a little bit more if rocky wants to have her portrait taken on here in the woods thank you guys for coming along on this one um, hopefully it gave you a little bit uh, more of a behind the scenes look on how some of this stuff might be made. It was a lot of fun to shoot, a lot of fun to have you guys kind of come along and, and show the, 
the background of it all to you. If you liked the video, subscribe, like, all of that normal stuff, and uh, I think we'll see you guys soon. Yeah.